Good morning. Looks like we got some basketball news to talk about today. What's happening? You didn't know. Dwight Howard just got traded again in another offseason. For the second straight offseason, Dwight Howard just got traded. Can count as a wash bomb if like Dwight's been traded this many times. Like at this point, I feel like people are used to it. But I do think this is pretty interesting for Charlotte and the Nets. The Nets apparently are using this in order to bolster their free agency possibilities in 2019, 20, and 2020, while Charlotte looks to potentially be rebuilding. It's not there yet. Like we don't know if that's gonna happen. But trading Dwight Howard, a piece that you thought was gonna help you compete with Kimball Walker and other pieces, is a pretty big deal. It's only really a big deal for Charlotte. Don't like freak out and be like, what about the Warriors? I'm like, this is a big deal for Charlotte because they recently have been like, we're not trading Kimball, we're not moving anything, we're probably gonna try and stay competitive, that type of stuff. Moving Dwight Howard for his second round picks and some cash considerations sort of suggest otherwise because while we do know that they have Cody Zeller, Dwight Howard was kind of the closest thing to a superstar and he's not even really, I mean he's still really good, but he's not a superstar in the way that he used to be where he was affecting the defense in such a powerful way. As far as Brooklyn, it's going to be a fun season to have Dwight Howard on the team. Hopefully he doesn't mess with the chemistry too much. I think in Atlanta, he was like kind of just clashing with Dennis Schroeder. Who's going to start? Will it be Dwight or Jared Allen? Because I was thinking about that and I just realized Jared Allen was having a really good rookie year. So that'll be another interesting wrinkle to see. I think if anyone Kenny Atkinson can handle, apparently Kenny Atkinson has coached Dwight before. So this won't be another new coach for Dwight to get used to. This is a coach that Dwight apparently historically has gotten along with. So I think Brooklyn, you know, gets a little bit more competitive and Charlotte potentially may rebuild. Well, this guy says, sometimes posting up will put you out of luck.